morning in Georgetown. Century egg porridge or law close up. Some laksa is a soup noodle, but it's sour based white rice noodle. Very typical wrecked two eggs. Oh, look at that. Okay, this is a new way of eating it. I never tried this way before. Still a coconut broth, and they give you extra Ooh. curry paste. I would totally recommend this place. We're at since I got this particular stall, the curry bee stall here. Good morning. We are at a quite busy of a food court in Penang Island. I think we're in Georgetown. Uh, for breakfast today, um, my stomach is not quite settled yet. So I'm having porridge, and this is a century egg porridge, which is like beidan um, I think it has like peanuts and salty eggs, uh, deep fried dough, here's the century eggs, it's chicken. Yeah. And I'm having soy milk as my drink. So how it okay, So I'm supposed to mix it all up. So I'm gonna mix it. Hold on. I'm gonna go in the zoom. It's good. Okay, definitely has. Mm -hmm. It's good. Some of have this. Has MSG, so feels nice and warm for my stomach right now. I'm gonna enjoy this. I'll show you guys more food stuff later. Oh, by the way, where I'm at right now, it's called Sunside Guy. Wow, and have like young, old, Malay, Chinese, all kinds of people here. Sunside Guy. I cannot zoom right now. Hold on, let's zoom closer. There you go, Sunside Guy. Okay. So another thing you're supposed to try when you come to Penang is something like this. It's called Lopak, and it's a lot of deep fried variety that you can have shrimp, fried shrimp frit fritter, fried fritter. There's tofu fried. I think this is a different thing fried. So pick one of these. Dip it in the sauce. Oh wait, let's do a close up. Yeah. Dip it in either a spicy sauce or a sweet sauce. So I'm gonna try the spicy one. Here we go, here we go, let's do it! Oh yeah! Oh, that's yam that I just had. That's really good. Really soft on the inside, but really crunchy on the outside. Okay, if you get a chance to come out here and try the loba of Penang. One more. When you come to Penang, you're supposed to have asam laksa. Asam laksa is a soup noodle, but it's sour base. It has like such fish in it. So let's give it a try for the soup first. Yeah. Alright, see this? This is like the flakes of fish. Mm. And the noodle is different. It's like this white rice noodle. I'm gonna mix it. Let's try. Mm. But it's sour and sweet and like flakes of fish and it has like a bit sweet in it. Okay, let's try it. Yeah, some laksa in Penang. Bye. Okay, it's a very typical breakfast in um, Malaysia is you eat like soft boiled eggs. Like that. We just took you to school. Yeah, if you scrape all of it out, usually they give you two eggs, coffee, 
I just want the toast in a bit. Okay, let's do that. You add the pepper and the soy sauce in it to your taste, and it's really good. And this is a very typical breakfast: two soft boiled eggs for breakfast. Oh, look at that! Okay, this is a new way of eating it. I never tried this way before. Why do I try? Why do this mm. is yeah. What's up? This is kaya the toast. So this has toast with butter. See, that's butter in there, and then the green is like sweet coconut spread. It's really good, really sweet and fragrant. So that's how you eat it for breakfast. Okay, that's for this one. So what I'm eating today, I'm eating what's called curry mi. In Penang, they call it curry mi. It's similar to laksa, but it's not exactly the same. The variation, I guess. It's still a coconut broth, and they give you extra Ooh. curry paste. So if you want to make it spicier, you can mix it in. This one actually comes with pig's blood, tofu puff. So this is like fried tofu. It's just like fish cake, or it it has it has it, and then the noodles. Usually they know to mix it for you. The eggs noodle and the vermicelli noodle for both. So let me mix it up and then I'll taste it. Let you know. Yeah. So kind of mix it. It's really hard to mix because the bowl is really tall. And this is only six ringgits too. They even give you squid in here, cuttlefish, a cuttlefish, and they also give you lamb in here too. And I really like this lamb. So let's give it a try. Too much. Okay, this part is tricky. Oh, that I can't do this part. Hold on. <laughs> okay, here we go again. Okay, ready? <laughs> yummy! <laughs> so yummy. This is really good. <gasps> oh, it's fresh. Oh, very very good. How about the cuttlefish? Mm. Also very fine. How about the tasu? Mm. It's good. It's very good. Everything's really good. Okay. I'm not a big fan of the pig split, so I might not eat this one. But everything else is good. How about the tofu? <laughs> I would totally recommend this place. We're at Tansai Gai. This particular stall, the curry mee stall here. If you get the chance to come to Penang, you can try the curry mee here. It's really good, quite good. Okay. Here is another hunt for my favorite non spicy noodle. This one is in Penang. There is entertainment over there. People are singing, so let me do this before they get loud. Oh. The morning is famous for the food I was going to eat. It's basically coming in. Let's go. 